I'm Emma Burns. I'm a PhD candidate in educational psychology. So our current research is on the broader topic of growth goals and so specifically we're looking at this new construct known as personal best goals. So in education we know that students set a variety of goals in order to achieve different things. So currently the two big ones that people have been looking at are mastery goals and performance goals but now we want to introduce this new type which is that students are competitive, but they're only self-competitive, and they're trying to achieve higher than what they achieved previously. So overall, we're creating this really larger contextualized map um, to look at personal best goals compared to other kinds of goals so that we can see which goals align closely with the best academic outcomes and what kind of environment they need to be in so that overall we can kind of look at these are the sorts of goals that we should emphasize and want kids to focus on because they promote higher achievement and higher engagement and then also this is the sort of environment and the sort of mindsets that we need to encourage kids to take in order to uh, create these sorts of goals. So it's important because we want to be able to optimally motivate students and so being able to motivate students based on things that are the most closely related to themselves. So one of the parts that we're looking at is that with personal best goals students choose the goals and students are the main source of the goals that they're picking. So goals aren't picked for them by their teachers or their parents, they're setting them and then they work towards it. And so the more students feel personally invested in their education, the more they're gonna get out of it. So that's one of the really important parts because obviously we want education to be a positive experience for students.